am so excited that we are finally getting back into the time of year when we have all these events to do mm -hmm. every single day of the week. But this is the part of the year that gets really hard to have this job, right? Because I want to go out and do stuff during the week. Kelly, what right? was it you said? It's when, exhausting. Yeah, when they were talking about something going on at like 8 o'clock, you were like, at night? At <laughs> night? That's when it starts? Uh, thankfully, Waterfront starts at 5 p.m. So, hey, if we wanted to... We can maybe uh, risk a little bit and stay up a little late tonight. We have temperatures in the 60s. It's really going to be a nice one. So if you want to head out, kick off the season on a very good note, it will be dry. There's no chance of rain in that forecast. Just a few clouds and some sunshine with some calm winds out there. We have some clear conditions right now for downtown Louisville, some indigo skies, a few clouds out there. But for the most part, we are nice and mild. Temperatures are starting out in the 40s and 50s. Staying nice and dry today, but that's going to change tomorrow. We are tracking our next system that will be bringing multiple rounds of rain and it could actually be kind of a washout of a day tomorrow afternoon. 46 right now, cooling off to the mid 40s, 34 in Brandenburg, 41 down in Hodgenville right now. So if you're heading out for maybe a lunch break today, we'll have some blue skies, only a few clouds, temperatures breaking into the 60s at that point. And then later this afternoon, if you're heading out right around 2, 3 p.m., We'll be in the upper 60s, and some of us lucky enough maybe to get close to 70s. We have a north wind today, so it'll be nice and light, uh, true to the temperature, or feel true to the temperature because of that wind is not too bad. Tomorrow morning, we will be waking up to some clouds, but notice our temperatures will all be in the 40s and 50s to start out the day. The first round will enter right around 1, 2 p.m. Widespread downpours in that forecast, especially at 6 p.m. This latest update that actually updated about five minutes ago slowed it down a little bit. So expect multiple rounds through dinner time, 6, 7 p.m. And then that second round, kind of that low pressure, will track farther uh, south. So 10:30 p.m. downpours expected still with Friday morning, another round expected. So really just anticipate multiple rounds of rain. You can see that low pressure right there as that wind is circulating counterclockwise. That low pressure will move over us Friday afternoon and behind it, maybe some scattered sprinkles possible. But for the most part, we will be drying out by 4 p.m. on Friday. So just in time for maybe some happy hour on Friday or a dinner uh, night um, it planned in that forecast. Uh, so we have some rain expected when we have over 24 hours of rainfall with multiple rounds. We're expecting maybe over an inch potentially picking up from tomorrow through Friday afternoon. So just know we have multiple rounds of rain, but the rain will knock our allergy report down to a low level for Thursday, but it will be right back to medium on Friday. So your seven day forecast, sunny and upper 60s today, rounds of rain tomorrow through Friday morning. I increase the rain chances on Friday because it is looking pretty wet for a 24 hour period. Then drying out Saturday for that mini marathon, expected to be dry. The rain chances that 20% is not until later in the evening on Saturday, maybe right around uh, opening night for Derby. We'll keep our eyes on that forecast for you.